Hey, what's going on, guys? You and me for the win. What a universe of Minecraft. It is his tutorials here. Sorry if I offended anyone when I do that accent. I just really like doing that accent. I don't know why. But yeah, uh, welcome to part 6 of my Minecraft modding 1.2.2 series. Um, I think it's part 6. I have no clue. I've been recording them all so far in a row, so I don't, I haven't like, you know, numbered them or anything. I've kind of been forgetting what numbers I just did after about three. So, yeah. So welcome back, and today in this episode we're going to be doing food. Um, I decided recipe, crafting recipes, I don't know, I just don't like them. Like. They're really awkward to do because they involve Jasons. So I will do them. Trust me, I'll do them after this one, uh, and that's a certainty. But I won't be recording that one on the same day because I won't be able to. Um, I'll actually be, be recording another food one after this, which will be food with potion effects after this one. So yeah. So we're going to make an item item called um. Just call it, uh, um, obsidian underscore apple equals new obsidian apple, and let's do that. And in here, we'll put obsidian. Apple. Now we are going to have more things in here, so just be prepared for that. Um, I know we're going to need false, but we'll need something else. We'll need two other things before that. So we're going to create the class. So objects dot items, and it's going to extend item food. And implement I has model finish <sighs> and yep there we go that took forever of course because you know Eclipse loved me and we'll just do this first so we'll do tutorial mod dot proxy dot register this zero and inventory and yes my eclipse is really slow but I've kind of got used to it now um, I've kind of caught up to it as in I'm faster than eclipse at this stuff um, so in the parameters for this one we need string name Float saturation int. Wait, no, I think it's double amount and boole boolean is wolf food. I think. Um, maybe it's not double amount, maybe it's in amount. Yeah, it's in amount. So we need to super off of uh, saturation uh, amount and also is wolf food. And enter. And that should fix this. Maybe we need to set the unlocalized name because otherwise it's not going to like me. I need to set the registry name to name.
means set creative tab to tutorial mod dot tutorial mod tab What's wrong here? Is it just in Boolean? No, it's not. It's in the mount. Wait, why is why is saturation not on there? Hold up, Control X. Let's let's get rid of this. Let's get rid of this. Let it add the constructor itself because it's not happy with me. Uh, yeah, in float Boolean. Oh, because I had it in the wrong order. See, that's what I don't like about this. <laughs> if you... yeah. And that should fix all the errors, yep. And we need to do item in it... Oh, item in it dot items dot add oh, what am I doing? add this and do that at the end import item in it save get rid of that import that if I haven't already add arguments right so we have string and then we have the amount so this is every half um, chunk basically every half drumstick uh, will be one so one would be half a drumstick two would be a full drumstick so we want this to be let's say 12 which is six drumsticks um, actually you know 10 five drumsticks and then it's float I think so uh, no saturation Yes, float saturation. Don't really know much about this value, so I'm just going to put, uh, uh, let's just say 1.6f? No, not 16f, <laughs> Jesus Christ. That would give me, like, infinite saturation. Right, 1.6f. Alright. So let's do the... Uh, I forgot to do the lang for this, not gonna lie. <laughs> Item dot obsidian and apple dot name is equal to obsidian apple. Save that and let's close all. Right, let's do the model. So instead of ingot it's obsidian Apple and change ingot to Apple. Right, let's create the texture. Hopefully, this shouldn't take too long. So, let me open paint.net and I'll just switch the window for you guys. Paint.net. Um, no, why not? I don't want that. Oof. <laughs> I just realised I was... oh, okay. Yeah, sorry about that, guys. I just renamed everything to Dark Apple. That's all I did. I didn't even know I still had paint.net open. should probably close this. Um, just in case it gets in the way. Don't save. Alright, there we go. So, now everything's named Dark Apple. We're gonna try run it, I suppose. Um, Lol. I should probably shouldn't do that just in case anyone has epilepsy. <sighs> so, let's see if this works. Yeah, you can see my mouse. <laughs> Oh, it's so zoomed in. 
I don't know if it'll look this zoomed in on the recording, but on my recording software it looks so zoomed in and quite blurry, actually. Hopefully it's not blurry. We'll find out. Wait, no, maybe we're on episode 7. You know, I don't know. <laughs> so, yeah, deal with it. Options, video settings, full screen on, full screen off. Right, let's see if it works. By the way, if anyone wonders, I'm using OBS to record uh, my computer. Let's see. So the apple's here. I didn't make it edible and creative. I will maybe do that. Um, I'll show you how to do that in the next like effects one. So, okay, I need to be hungry. And it's on easy, isn't it? No, it's on normal. Let's put it on easy. We should see it's a pretty good apple. Um, if I do slash effect at S, hunger 100, 100. S clear and if I eat you can see it gives one, two, three, four, five hunger bars. One, two, three, four. And that should also give me loads of saturation too. Right, but anyway guys, um that's about it for this video. Uh, if you want to see more videos like this, please do subscribe and be sure to leave a like. So, uh, yeah, I will see you guys in the next video. Peace.